Welcome back to Linux Network. DXVK is a piece of software that acts like a translator for video games. Many popular games are built to run on Windows and use a technology called DirectX to handle graphics. DirectX is essentially a set of instructions that games use to tell your computer how to render things like explosions, characters, environment and other visual effects. The problem is that Linux doesn't natively understand DirectX because it uses a different graphic system called Vulkan. So, if you try to run a game designed for DirectX on Linux, your system won't know what to do with those instructions. That's where DXVK comes in. DXVK is like a bridge or a translator. It takes these DirectX instructions from the games and converts them into Vulkan instructions that Linux understands. This allows Linux users to play many Windows-only games smoothly, even though they were never designed to run on Linux in the first place. For a long time, gaming on Linux was tough. Most games were built exclusively for Windows, which meant Linux users had very limited options. If you want to play a game, you either need a Windows PC or had to dual boot Windows alongside Linux. But that's changing and DXVK is one of the big reasons why. With DXVK, you can now run many Windows games on Linux without major performance issues. It's a key component of tools like Proton, a future of Steam Play, and Wine, software that helps Linux run Windows applications. Thanks to DXVK, gaming on Linux has become much more accessible and enjoyable. Today, you can fire up your favorite games on Linux with just a few clicks, and in many cases they perform just as well as they would on Windows, sometimes even better. Imagine you're visiting a foreign country where everyone speaks a language you don't understand. To communicate, you hire a translator who listens to what you say, converts it into the local language, and then translates the response back to you. That's essentially what DXVK does, but for Windows games and graphics. Here is the process. The game sends instructions to the computer using DirectX. DXVK intercepts these instructions, it translates the DirectX instructions into Vulkan instructions, and your Linux system processes the Vulkan instructions and renders the graphics on your screen. This translation happens in real time, and is so fast that you probably won't even notice it's happening. It's a bit like having a super efficient translator who can keep up with a fast paced conversation without missing a bit. DXVK isn't just any translator, it's an incredibly optimized one. Here is why it's so important. DXVK is designed to be highly efficient so it doesn't slow down on your games. In fact, many games running through DXVK on Linux perform just as well as they do on Windows. Some games even benefit from Vulkan's modern features, which can lead to slightly better performance compared to DirectX on Windows. DXVK supports DirectX 9, 10 and 11, three major versions of DirectX that are used by tons of games. This wide compatibility means you can play everything from older classics to relatively recent releases. Like much of the Linux ecosystem, DXVK is open source. This means anyone can view, modify and improve its code. The open source nature of DXVK ensures that it's constantly evolving and getting better, thanks to the contributions from developers around the world. If you're a gamer using Linux, you've probably heard of Proton. Proton is a tool developed by Valve, the company behind Steam, that lets you play Windows games on Linux. It's built on top of Wine, but Proton includes a bunch of extra tools to improve performance and compatibility. One of those tools is DXVK. Here's how they work together. Proton provides the framework for running Windows games on Linux. DXVK handles the translation of DirectX graphics to Vulkan. This combination has revolutionized games on Linux. With Proton and DXVK, you can install and play many Windows games on Steam as if they were native Linux games. You don't need to tweak anything or fiddle with complicated settings. In most cases, it's as simple as clicking install and play. To fully appreciate DXVK, it helps to understand Vulkan. Vulkan is a modern graphics application programming interface, in short API, that works across multiple platforms including Linux, Windows and even Android. It's known for being efficient and giving developers more control over hardware compared to older APIs like DirectX 11 or OpenGL. When DXVK translates DirectX instructions into Vulkan, it's essentially taking advantage of Vulkan's flexibility and performance benefits. This is one of the reasons why many games run so well on Linux despite being designed for Windows. The good news is that you usually don't need to install DXVK manually. If you're using Proton on Steam, DXVK is already included and works automatically. Just enable Proton in your Steam settings and you're good to go. If you're using Wine outside of Steam, you may need to install DXVK separately. 
This involves downloading the DSVK package, copying the necessary files to your Wine prefix and configuring Wine to use DXVK. While it's not overly complicated, it does require some basic familiarity with Linux and Wine. While DXVK is amazing, it's not perfect. Here are a few things to keep in mind. Although DSVK is highly optimized, the translation process can add a tiny bit of overhead. For most games, this isn't noticeable, but extremely demanding games may lose a few frames per second. Since the SVK relies on Vulkan, you need a Vulkan compatible GPU and drivers. Most modern GPUs from AMD, Nvidia and Intel support Vulkan, so this isn't a major issue for most users. The gaming landscape on Linux is evolving rapidly and the SVK plays a huge role in that. As more developers and players adopt Vulkan and tools like the SVK, the gap between Windows and Linux gaming continues to shrink. Major companies like Valve are heavily investing in Linux gaming as seen with the Steam Deck which uses Linux as its operating system. With advancements in DXVK and related technologies, we can expect even better performance, broader compatibility and a smoother gaming experience on Linux in the coming years. In summary, DXVK is a game changer for Linux gamers. It acts as a translator that converts DirectX graphics instructions into Vulkan, allowing Linux to run Windows games beautifully. Thanks to the SVK tools like Proton and the power of Vulkan, gaming on Linux has never been easier or more enjoyable. So, if you're new to Linux and gaming, know that the SVK is one of the unsung heroes making it all possible. With just a little effort, you can dive into the world of Linux gaming and experience your favorite games in a whole new way. That's it. And as always, if you found this video useful, please like, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next one.